Pretty ribbons of blue Wrap your presents to your darling so true Hey everybody, Donna here at Diamond Art Joy. Welcome today. Got something a little different today. I've talked about washi before, but um, I just wanted to show you a recent order I got. I'm trying to, to prepare and beef up all of my supplies for my planner for next year. So um, I uh, partook of some Black Friday deals and I do have a subscription to Simply Gilded, so I have a few other things too I want to go through with you, so welcome. I'm going to set this aside here and start with this box. This is the subscription for December from Simply Gilded. It's owned and operated by Irene. Um, she does all of the designing and she is the owner of Simply Gilded. So here's my box. I just cut the top off, but it, you know, everything comes in this cute little pink box every month. And this is a postcard, journal card or whatever. And it looks like it's layered here. It's got like this stained glass effect on it with another scene behind it. And you can use it as a postcard. Um, I'll get to, this is some extra washi, I suppose. Let's see, some kind of characters. sweet isn't it pretty color of pink she uses this uh, natural packing material which is neat oh wow yeah and she puts all of the washi in a box every month so they don't go you know moving around in your other box so I think there's like I don't know six or nine rolls in here and it also comes with a different pen each month, a different color that coordinates with her theme. Guys, you have enough light. I don't know if you can see everything. But yeah, this one's yellow, which is really pretty. Okay, set this aside. And then these are the stickers. So living an enchanted life is her theme for the month. And there's a set of stickers in here that um, go into your journal or whatever you want to use them for. We'll look at them. Anybody else out there have a washi subscription or a planner type subscription? Oh, look, they're so cute. Teapot and castles. She tries to do different colors and different themes. Every month you get one of these as well. And you get a series of stickers for your planner. Some larger ones. We've got the days, the week. And some other coordinating stickers. Bows are her, her thing. Yeah. So that's really nice set of stickers. Let's look in the washi. I'm a washi freak. Boy. Oh, look at the back of the box. That's sweet. So these are all the... Oh, this one's dark. They're both dark here. I can't tell what they are. I think they're cellophane. This one has castles on it. And this one's a landscape. Okay, let's look, open up one of these, see what it looks like. I've never seen this before. She always talks about her upcoming releases too on Instagram and I missed this month. So this was all gonna be a surprise for me. Let's see. 
Yeah, it's cellophane. Can you guys tell? Let's see. I put it on the plastic here, but that's what it looks like. That's sweet. That'll show up nice in a planner. And it's stained glass. Oh, that's different. I don't think I've seen her do this before. But yeah, so that's the subscription. I also um, ordered some stuff when she was having a sale on her washi and other things. And that's what's in this box right here. Came in a bigger box, which is really sweet. It has decorations on it. There's uh, some of these are, this is a freebie. Love is love. That's a journal card, I suppose. That was a freebie as well. Also, this was a freebie, which was shocking to me because I only ordered the washi. And this um, is sticker storage. She makes and designs these different little booklets to store um, your stickers <sighs> like this. You know, you can just flip through. Um, it's got a little pocket here, and so you could do it double-sided. But yeah, thank you, Irene. It's nice to get a freebie. That's really nice. And then her little character, Juniper, which is a little bunny rabbit. This was a freebie, too. <laughs> she just, um, you can just set her around to help you with your journaling. <laughs> and her little heart feet pads. Oh, that's sweet. So Juniper can help me today. So anyway, guys, this is the selection of washi that I got. Of course, me and my tie-dyed um, I'm a tie-dye freak, so I had to get these, right? And they've got um, sparkles in them, which is nice. So two of these are the same, but um, I've got a couple other different designs here. <laughs> Love it. Let me see. This one is the sky. It's got birds on it and stars. It's rose gold stars. I'm hoping you can see this well. I've got some yellow, so this will be for the springtime. I've got rabbits, uh, bows, tulips, and butterflies. Uh, just some nice light mint green with the little um, dots, gold dots on there. And let me see. Oh, yeah, this is a beagle. <laughs> Can't go wrong with a beagle or a Labrador. I had to have me some beagle washi. Oh, yeah, zebras. Zebras out in the... Uh, the, um, what's it called? The Serengeti. Isn't that pretty? The colors are nice. We've got strawberries. So yeah, all these are on sale. Simplygilded.com. Uh, pine cones and leaves for this one. Um, this one's a more, I think, a Japanese flavor with uh, the reds and clouds and gold. Uh, I got some more butterflies. This matches the yellow one, but it's green. So they're the same. And these are similar, but different sizes and a little bit different colors. I'm not sure if you can see in this very well, but oh yeah, here's some more tie-dye. It's got the, the sparkle spray on them. So yeah, you know, I can use this on the planners and I can also use it on diamond. 
um, canvases, you know, as um, to go around where the, there is over pour on the glue. Let's see. I can't tell what this is. <sighs> um, well, it looks like an outdoor scene. It's got some leaves and we've got bows. I'm not quite sure. Here's some tulips. Uh, here's pink. This is travel. See, there's an airplane and all of the... Um, Contrails are um, sparkles. <laughs> Wouldn't that be cool to see that in the sky? Oh, I love this one. Oh, yeah, this has got some holographic uh, design on it with the flowers. Oh, yes, the purple. Very nice. And last, I have some more spring um, colors here. Flowery. Tape. So, I have a great selection here to add to my stash of washi. And um, again, you know, she's she's so nice. She's got this is her own business, and uh, she sends you freebies and lots of love. And you can't go wrong with an order from Irene at simplygilda.com. So there's that. Next, I have a couple of new places to tell you about. I've been ordering from here for a long time. This is from Crafty Corgi House. That's Adrian at Crafty Corgi House on Etsy. She has her own shop. She's out in California. And I order nice washi from her. She always sends such a nice note. And, and she sends... Um, nice Japanese candy every time, like a different type of candy to, to try out, which is a nice surprise. So let's look at this washi. I guess she's a corgi lover, but here's a little note she does. Crafty Corgi House on Etsy. I'll try to link everything down in the description. So I'm not sure. These are these are hard candies right here. Oh, that's got a panda on it, but it kind of looks like Chick-fil-A colors, colors, doesn't it? <laughs> okay, so I have Baby Harp Seal, which I absolutely love. I used to collect Baby Harp Seals, the stuffed ones, and I always wanted to go see one, you know, out in the uh, near the North Pole, take like a helicopter out to see um, Baby Harp Seals. Um, but I uh, haven't been able to do that yet. I've been up almost at the North Pole, but wasn't able to get an excursion out. But anyway, they're sweet. We've got some snow people that look like that. So that'll be cute here for the winter time. They do like January and February planner stuff. Um, this would be pretty for the fall. I like those colors. It's brown. It's got a little bit of orange in there and gold. Um, this is a scene, a lighthouse scene with the water. Of course, purple. Um, yes, this beautiful orange here. Flowers. And last, I have a mountain scene, which is really pretty. Oh, and um, besides the washi, I also got some stickers from um, Adrian at Crafty Corgi House. Of course, there's some seal stickers. <laughs> and you know, you know, sometimes when you're journaling, you're talking about certain things, or in your planner, you might have a little theme going for the week. And I could do like a, a week of seals and baby harp seals and use them as my, you know, my stickers and my washi tape for the week. She packaged everything really nice. 
and puts this in here so everything doesn't get bent, which is really nice. So we saw that one. Um, this is different here. Oh, these are otters? Oh yeah, sea otters. Oh, I saw a sea otter one time. I was on a cruise up to Alaska and I looked out my, um, from my uh, little, uh, it's not, not a deck, but we had a sliding glass door and a little um, veranda area and we saw this big sea otter floating on his back right by the ship, you know, just cracking clams on his belly. <laughs> it was hilarious. It was amazing, you know, because they're not scared. I guess they're used to all these ships going up there. And um, so we've got videotape of him. But it was really cute. Kind of reminds me of this. But yeah, he was just floating along. It's like he was waving and eating his clams. <laughs> uh, what's this? More otters here. Very cute. They kind of look like they're... These stickers are made out of um, like a paper mache type material or even like wood. You know what I mean? Like a, a woody type paper, which is really paper. <laughs> but it has some texture to it when it, it's outlined in gold. So um, love the stickers. Not exactly sure what these are. I think they're explanations of what the stickers is, these symbols here. But here we go with more animals, sea animals, and uh, jellyfish. She has some really cool stuff, Adrian does. Check out her um, Etsy site. She has other stuff as well, but um, she's very sweet. She'll ship the, the same day or the very next day. I mean, she's right on top of everything, and she sends freebies, so check out her shop, Crafty Corgi House on Etsy, and she's in California. So, let me put that over here. Last, has anybody heard of the CoffeeMonstersCo.com? That is Helen, and she is from the Vancouver area. She started this business when she was 17. And she's now, I think, I don't know, 23 or 24 or something like that. So um, I found her website and Etsy shop. She has both um, several years ago to get my planner stuff. She created all these little characters here. And um, she ran with it. I guess he's the Coffee Monster Co. <laughs> or the Coffee Monster. But Helen is a very creative individual, um, and she makes stickers. She makes um, all of these uh, planner, different type of planner um, sizes and that sort of thing. She does themes for the year, the month. So I've got... This particular order was for the first six months of next year, so January through June, and she came up with designs and flower doodles. She's doing birth flowers for each month. That's her theme for next year. So I got that. Um, let me show you this first. Here's her little calendar thing she comes up with. Each calendar, and she's got her characters, and then she's got the birth month flowers in here, looks like. So basically, let me show you. I think I was going to do a different um, video on just uh, planners, but I'm hoping to get to that before the end of the year. But here's my planner from, from this year. And um, this is the Hobonichi Cousin Planner from Japan. Um, it's very popular. I think they sold, I don't know, 10 million or something this year, but it has all different types of sections. You can do pretty much everything you need to do in this book. And um, you can get an English version now. This, this happens to be a Japanese version. So, But anyway, these little stickers would go here. Last year I made these myself. I downloaded a freebie from her and I just printed it on my printer. But they would go here up front. It just... You know, it covers up the original calendar that the 
planner came with. I mean, you could see it underneath, but it just makes it cuter because these were her characters. And then this year, last year, I don't remember what her theme was. I think it was food. She did foods for every month, and this year it's flowers. I mean, next year it's flowers. Really cute. But yeah, you've got, in this planner, you've got uh, the monthly, the weekly section, you've got a monthly section, you've got individual day sections that you can use for journaling or whatever you need to do. Very, very fun if you're into that sort of thing. But anyway, these stickers go with this planner, this Hobonichi cousin. Anyway, here's January's um, theme. I've got all kinds of stickers here. Plain ones that you can put in the column and you can write, you know, appointment or whatever on it, on this, instead of just in the calendar. I mean, you're, you're just kind of like making it pretty. That's pretty much what you're doing. You're just prettying up your calendar and your planner. There's February and the colors. March. She also has a huge web uh, YouTube site. And again, I told you um, she has um, a website, the Coffee Monsters Co. Dot com, and it's monsters with a Z. I'll link everything below. Here is May, and there's June, and she always gives you a free little card that you can put in your planner storage if you wanted to or whatever. But those um, go in the planner, and then these are coordinating other stickers, like little sticky note stickers that coordinate with each month as well. More fun <laughs> dots that coordinate. And like for the whole year, all these colors go together. It doesn't matter which month it is. They're all coordinating colors, which is another fun thing that I like that she does. These are tabs that you can put here. See how the tabs go here? She just has a new set with colors and that sort of thing. So you can tab through here and find the section that you need, the month, whatever. And so I got some of those different colors. I got clear um, white ones and colored ones. And it can be used on any type of planner. It doesn't have to be this planner. So what I do here, I have a storage system for my kits. I have, I mean, I got this little um, clear booklet. I used to send notes to you on those little things. But yeah, I've got... Uh, from other years, I've got the whole um, theme stored in these little booklets. So I can just go and find what I want. So I would store these in this booklet too, or probably another booklet. Because <laughs> this one's full, right? It's like having a lot of paintings. you got to have, a girl's got to have stickers for her planners and journals and that sort of thing, right? And you got to have the washi and all that stuff's got to go together. You know what I mean? So anyway, I store these stickers in little booklets like this. And let's see, I also have these little booklets, which are nice. They, see, they're, they're like coordinating things from last year. This, see, this is January of last year, but I didn't use all of the, the stickers. But you can use them any year or any time, you know? Here I've got some space, so I can just add these to the back of here 
and make my 2024 section. So anyway, that's fun. Okay, um, that's all I have today. Talking about washi, stickers, uh, journal, planner, stickers, that sort of thing. Oh yeah, and you see I'm using my nice little bookmark here that I did for with the uh, diamond art. Yeah. Anyway, thanks for joining me. If you have any questions about any of these places, just leave it in the comment and I'll be happy to answer you. Um, all three of these shops are wonderful, wonderful shops. And I would highly recommend all of them for your washi, sticker, planner, journal needs. And uh, glad you stopped by and I will see you next time, guys. Thanks for stopping. Okay, bye now. Pretty ribbons of blue Wrap your presents to your darling so true